Hey guys and girls, and thank you for watching another episode of the Xbox Tester. My name is Maurice. Today we're gonna play Inertial Drift on Xbox Series S. So this game just got a new gen overhaul, I think a couple of weeks ago, and uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to playing this game. It was really good when it first came out, so and I think it's still really good. Let's go check it out. First of all, let's see how much data this game is on your SSD. And that's 4.6 GB. The game is not on Game Pass or anything, but you can buy it for like 20 euros. I think it's also sometimes already in sale for like 10 euros or something. So I would say wait for that. Um, the game is now new gen upgraded and um, it's Xbox Gen 9, Gen Scarlet. Let's go start it up. You guys, if you like this kind of content, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. It means a lot for me. It means even more for the channel. You can also hit the bell icon. I upload almost on a what, daily basis. New games, old games, updates on games, even a little bit of hardware here and there. So, Inertial Drift is a two stick racing game yeah that's something you don't see every day with one stick you drive and with the other stick you um yeah you drift skip come on let's do this this looks really sharp by the way Still need to get used to the controls a little bit better. But this looks sharp, you guys. Whoa, darn it. I need to be faster. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, you can see already I'm really bad at this. But yeah, you steer, just normal steer, and then you can, with the other stick, you. Oh my goodness. Oh, 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 ouch. And this game is super addictive. And it looks really sharp. By the looks of it, it's 1440p at 60 FPS all the way through. My goodness. This looks sharp. Okay, it's a smaller indie game, but still. Pretty impressed. Trust me, it wasn't that sharp with the original Xbox One version. Here we go. <clears throat> Hopefully the second round goes a little bit better. already going a lot better shouldn't have said that <laughs> oh yes 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 oh almost I almost had him. My goodness. Come on, Maurice, you can do this. 
There's probably people who are, are laughing at me right now. At my incredibly dumb skills. No! This is a really good new gen upgrade, by the way, you guys. I really dig it. Come on, Maurice, you can do it. Yes, yes. Whoop, whoop. Oh. Thankfully. Now let's do time attack. This game is actually pretty fun. If you want to play an original racing game, an original arcade racing game, then I would definitely try this one out if I were you. of the brakes a little bit better I think. No 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 Oh no 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 come on Maurice Earl Blue Theater That's better Come on, come on, come on, go, 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 go. Perfect. Can I get gold? You know what? I'm already happy with bronze, to be honest. I think I got the gold time. Finish your friend. <gasps> I did it! Yay! City Skylink. Snow Mountain Sprint. Oh let's let's do that one. For once. Here we go. Three, two, one, ignition. Oh yeah. This control is so perfect. You have no idea how good this works. Why not more racing games use this uh, twin stick driving mechanic is a complete riddle to me. Feels a little bit like Tokyo Drift. smaller indie game yeah kudos but 
never know. Snow keeps on falling on my head. Oh, oh, oh my. Come on, Maurice. guys this is inertial drift running on xbox series s and um yeah if you are searching for a very awesome uh arcade racer with really unique controls i can definitely recommend this game um i really want to thank you for watching if you want to watch any other videos of mine there's probably something right down there in the in the video right now and yeah thanks for watching till next time bye